And I'm postulating that the function of art, and I include in this category creative work in science, that is creation in the widest sense, anyone, is to put us in touch with what we know and don't know that we know. And the actually the whole concept of originality is now, as it were, officially dead. You don't need new ideas, and if the writer uses sets and characters from another writer, his work will be judged on its own merit. To see what the writer is trying to do and how well he is succeeding, invisibility, to spot plants and tricks, and pretty soon the expansion of awareness becomes common knowledge. Well, that's, that's pretty now the cut-ups simply apply the montage technique to writing, and these first cut-ups appeared in minutes to go. People were upset, angry, especially critics and other writers. Um, and we were accused of cheating. People felt that it mm -hmm. wasn't fair to produce writing with a pair of scissors. We were accused of plagiarism and of promulgating a cult of unintelligibility. Yeah. Now, yes. an artist sees it, he puts so. it on canvas or paper or film, and at first the public does not see it. There is rejection, ridicule, and anger, and after a few years, everybody sees it. The cut-ups are now a more or less accepted uh, technique for uh, fictional characters. He describes the uh, parasite is, is speaking in little squigs and giggles and turkey gobbles. And that is a virus invasion. That is a virus or a parasite taking over a human body. And you tend to consuming all the information. Fictional character. You begin to see I'm just a recorder. So in, instead of being sort of an invitation to license, it is uh, very much the contrary. But white shadows play, play out charades of greed and selfishness and stupidity. Yeah. The whole screen you think of as reality may quite suddenly go blank. This is the way the world ends, not with a bang but a click.